What's up guys? Grimly. Um, today I'm gonna be, well, I, it's not exactly an unboxing because I couldn't bring the packaging in because of obvious reasons. Um, but I got some cartwheels as you can see. And I had not opened these yet. I promise. All I did was take them out <clears throat> of the mailer and throw the mailer away. Um, of course, wash my hands. So, yeah, I'm gonna be unboxing unboxing these and reviewing them. So, this is what it came with. Um, this little note. Um, follow Simon on Instagram at Cartwheels. I think, yeah. And, <clears throat> yeah, so these are the contents. I'm pretty sure this is tape. From the side, I could tell it was tape. But, yeah, this is Cartwheels tape. So, um, I've never tried it. It feels pretty okay but yeah i uh, i think it might be china tape but i'm not sure but i'm gonna try this on later so yeah gave me two sheets i'm pretty sure every order comes with this so now for the actual wheels i really like the packaging it's pretty neat um and we're gonna slide them out oh cartwheel stickers yes sir Yo, cartwheel stickers. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna... There you go. What? Another sticker sheet? Okay. I don't think those are stickers. That's just a card. But there you go. Oh, shoot. Yo. These are so dope. I got the white cores. Um, but, yeah. So, it has this little business card thing. And the cartwheel sticker sheet. I really like cartwheel stickers. Alright, so these are the wheels. Man, these look so cool. Um, these are, I got the mini cores, but, because <clears throat> I really like small wheels. On my main setup here, I have Rolling Fingers, Z cores, and Oak Minis. So this is my third set, small wheels. These look really dope. Take them out, oh shoot. Alright, oh. These feel, these feel, um, way different than I expected. They feel really good, though. Um, they look just as small as an Oak Mini. Let me grab an Oak Mini real quick. Alright, so I have an Oak Mini here and a Rolling Finger Z-Core. So this is the Z-Core and this is the Mini. And then this is the cartwheel. So it's a probably the biggest of the three. It's probably the biggest of the three. Um, and it looks the coolest in my opinion. Because of like the shape when it curves in here. I'll have close up shots at the end. But yeah I'm going to slap these on my board. And I'll be back with you guys after. Alright. That's the board. I'll set up the cartwheels. Wow, I've not tried a trick on it yet, so I'm just gonna... All right. Whoa. These feel really cool. So my setup is um in blessed deck off Instagram you should definitely go get one I make them um, and they're really affordable um, 34 millimeter black base plate dynamic trucks and of course cartwheels and teak tuning um, they look right off the bat they look really cool on um, these trucks and I've seen pictures with BRTs and they look really cool on BRTs very slick um, I can definitely say that these are my new these are my new favorite wheels. Um, it's kind of hard for me to say that because I fell in love with this um, Rolling Finger Z Core when I first got them. But 
honestly, I really think that these top the um, Z cores, at least for me, because I've always really liked urethane, the properties of urethane, you know, it squeaks, it's um, pretty grippy, and they're really solid, but ever since I tried the Z core, I haven't really gone back to um, urethane, because um, I really like the huge like ride surface, the whole wheel is basically just flat, and there's no like curvature, um, the whole wheel is basically the ride surface, which I really love, and they feel better in my opinion, and they're more slippy, I've been liking slippier wheels, and these are the perfect in between, these are like the perfect, just perfect wheel in my opinion, um, I love this size, I'm definitely going to be picking up more, so, um, yeah, so when you're using them, they feel a little rough at first, um, but once you break them in, they're really, really um, smooth. Um, I haven't. I don't think these are fully broken in yet, but they're really smooth right now. Uh, so yeah, let me see if I can get a heel flip. There you go, nolly flip. That's good. That's good. Two hours later. Okay. Yeah. These are my favorite wheels. Um, so, as you can see, the shape kind of rounds off near the axle. And I really like that. It looks cool. And I'm not sure if there's a purpose for that. I think it helps the bearing keep in place. Um, but it looks really cool and I dig it, so why not? As you can see, there's actually a core in there. I got the white ones because I thought they just look good on anything. Yeah, the bearings aren't really that good. But to be honest, I don't think having good bearings in fingerboarding is all that important. Yeah, like I said before, these are the perfect in-between. If you really like plastic... But urethane also, I think that you're going to like these better than both. So yeah, I definitely recommend you go pick up a pair. Um, sorry if I'm like talking kind of quiet and stuff. Um, I have allergies. Allergies, okay. Not the other thing you're thinking. But um, yeah, cartwheels, go get some mini cores. And they're actually pretty good price. Like, um... They're cheaper than oak wheels, um, I, I think, I'm pretty sure. So one thing I forgot to mention about the wheels is that um, when you first get them, the, I'm not sure if it's honestly mine, just mine, but like the inside, um, there's kind of a part where it's touching the um, lock nut slightly. And so it creates kind of a rattling noise. But, um, I heard that once you break it in, um, the rattling noise is going to be gone. So, um, yeah. <coughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? Yeah. Go get some cartwheels. Ben Grimley. Peace out. Cartwheels are freaking lit, bro. This deck is fire, bro. Yeah.